Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Wallace and Gromit's Grand Adventures for more point and click adventure game action. We are back where we left off. We're all in this big sand pit. We've managed to rearrange everyone so that Wallace is pretty much at the door now. And hopefully we're going to go about and find our way out of this place. So here we go. Wallace, can you move into the gap? Oh, and here we are. Oh, much obliged everyone. Now I can put my plan into effect. What is the plan? Really? <laughs> Do something. Of course his plan is to ask Gromit to do it. Gromit will save the day again. Whoa. What the hell is going on? The whole place is booby trapped. What the hell? <laughs> Oh, okay. Um, we're in control. What do we do? What do we have in our invent? Oh, God. Okay. We do have things in our invent, but I can't really look at it. Can we run past the end of this? I don't think we can. Can we get off of it? Right. Can we do anything? We can't go in there. Oh, we can stop here, though, to look in our invent. Okay. Shut up. Stop asking for help. Can we? Hang on. Right, can we jam that somehow? Maybe we can jam that. I'm here, I'm here. Can we do anything with this? We can. Oh, what was that? <clears throat> what was that thing that we picked up? Was it the entire ball cleaner? It was. Can we use that on here? No. Shut up. Can we use this? No. Can we... Yeah, I know, I know. I'm trying to figure out what to do. Leave me alone. Right, we can use the measuring club on it. Ah! So can we hit something with that? Like a ball or something? Right, so we can put that into there. So, Oh, hang on. What was that? Use the panels. So, I don't really... Can we get in here? Use the chomping gate. So, can we go through it? No, it doesn't look like it. Okay. Can we use the butler thing? We can. What's taking you so long, lad? Right, we couldn't grip onto that. That's interesting. Uh, okay. Ah, oh, damn, I don't want to go there. <laughs> This is actually quite difficult. Right, let's take a rest here. Is there anything we can chuck into here? No. Okay. Uh, can we use the ball cleaner? No. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to. I'm trying to. So this is on here. This has got to hit something, right? Question is, can, what's it got to hit? A mushroom? Get us out of here. No. Help. Help, I, Help. Help. I mean, Please we don't help. have many items, help. so. I'm trapped. I can't move my arms at all. Will it? No. Not. So we can run. Please. Help. Is there anything Somebody we can do down help. on this side? Help us. We can't get out. No. Help. So it's got to involve the clock, there? right? Help or this us, thing. Right, so that... So can that crush help, something? Can we crush something in there? Help. No. Open this door. Can we crush we anything in there? Get it out of here. We're in here. Shut up. 
It literally Ooh, won't, unless we've got to put this in there. Can we put this measuring club in there to jam that up? So we can get into that part, or does that not work? Ah, yeah, here we go. Okay, we're in. Right, let me in, let me in. Don't close on me. <laughs> Right, okay, what can we get, get from here? here? We can get the snooker cue. Oh. What the hell? <laughs> What's that about? Um, we can ring the bell, which maybe means we can get the butler to come along. Uh, anything we can do with the snooker table? No. But we can What's ring this, right? Right, so he comes along. Can we put anything on his tray? No. Can we take the teacup? We can. Right, so we've got a teacup. Uh, I'm not really sure what we can do with that. Can we, can we put anything on there? No. The wrench, maybe? No. Uh, the golf jokes? Help. No. Get out of here. Help. Help, I say. Help. Hmm. Help. Please help. So help. none of none of these things work. I'm I can't move me out All right, well, can we get out? Get... No. Can no. we just go out now? Help. Please. What if we take help. this out? Is the butler Is stuck? Yeah, help. the butler's stuck in we there now. So help. can we... Help. What can we do with the cup of tea? That's the question. Can we use the cup of tea on this then? No. Huh. Right, so that jammed that up anyway. Shut up, or you can stay in there forever. Right, I don't... Can we do anything with the snooker cue then? Because that's literally the only thing we seem to be able to interact with. Um, so let's jam this back open again. Ronnie! I hear you, Wallace. Don't worry. Right, in we go. We've got to be able to do something with it, right? We've got to be able to. Get us out of here! Right, so that flaps down. So can we... We use anything on it? Help! No. Can we use the wrench on it? No. Uh, hmm. What happens if we do this? What's taking you so long, lad? Nothing. What can we do with the brass butler then? Because that seems like the only thing we can interact with. What's going on out there, Gromit? So he did something there to the tray. Okay. So we've got to put something on there, I'm guessing. Could we put the tea back on? Does that work? No. Lend a hand, lad. We tried. Shift up no. Okay. No. Huh, this is actually quite difficult. I'm not really sure what I've got to do here. What happens if we remove this? Right, so he goes back out. Let's go in again. I know who it is. Just wait. <laughs> help! Is anybody there? Somebody help! Uh, right. Okay. So. Help! Help! Anybody! Anybody! Shut up! Help! 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 Help!
Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Oh, we can use this on here! Can you use that on the other one as well? We can. Oh my god, this shouting is so annoying. So they seem to be... They seem to be going down the hole now. Get us out of here. So can we use... I don't know, I don't want to go through. Can we use the club now to like smack the cups of tea? Is that a thing? Okay, let's try that, shall we? Let's try using the club in here. See if it smacks the cups of tea around. What's taking you so long, lad? Right, I think it's worked. Okay. <laughs> yeah, here we go. Right, okay. There's... <laughs> it's putting the fire out. I see. Oh my god. What a crazy puzzle. Right, okay. Do we just let them out now, or...? Where's all the sand gone? Phew! Thanks, lad. Close friends are a fine thing, but that was a bit too close. Well, why people are so keen on country clubs is a mystery to me. <laughs> then you meant what you said in there about Quitting prickly thicket. For you, my little sprig of healing. Uh, just terror. a second, Yay. Yay. I don't oh, think I've been introduced to this. Oh, show. good, they're getting together. Romantic. We've solved it. <laughs> Most invigorating. Cleans out the pores. Reminds me of the good old days in the Sahara. Oh, God. Oh, no, Constable Divins, I hear on Grapevine there may be another. Uh, Opening at Prickly Thicket. And I've heard a certain grocery shop may be reopening soon, too. Oh, look at that. Well, Seems like everything's solved. Say, Golden Retrieval's first professional investigation has gone rather. <coughs> Wallace? Oh. This is rather awkward for me to say. I, I, I mean, I know your feelings about me. Oh, uh, you do? But you see. In the heat of adversity, I've discovered that my heart belongs to another. That's okay, don't worry oh. about that. I'm right so good. So, please, don't say anything to prolong our agony. I must therefore return this to you. Yes! We've done it! We've saved oh, Wallace. Yes, That's two close shaves in one afternoon. I don't know about you, but I could murder a copper. <laughs> Oops. Hang on, just a sec. What's he doing? Time for some cheese, methinks, Gromit. What do you fancy, man? Either more Wensleydale. Well, and there it is, the end. Oh, what a crazy ending that was. Um... <laughs> Where do I start with this game? It's absolutely amazing. I didn't really know what to expect when I came into it, as I don't with, with all of these blind playthroughs that I do. But um, when Frost came, uh, requested it and, and said that he thought I'd enjoy it, um, I mean, I love Wallace and Gromit, but I wasn't sure how a Wallace and Gromit game by Telltale would go, to be quite honest. But man, it's incredible. Each episode was just got better and better and better. The puzzles are quite easy but at times a little bit tricky which is a good balance I think and it feels like another Wallace and Gromit movie to me um, that's one thing that I've noticed these early Telltale titles they stuck so true to the world that they made the game in 
you know you, you have back to the future the game you had this one tales of monkey island things like that they all felt like they were additions to the existing titles in each of those series and I, I really do feel like this as good as some of the later telltale titles were i feel like this was the golden age of telltale games when they did games like this it's just so well put together and I, I just love it i love this game so much it's been such fun playing it um and i've loved interacting with all you guys as well in your, in your comments and things like that seeing what you think of it um, helping you guys relive it because some of you guys played this years and years ago and I never got a chance to so I'm really happy that some of you guys have been able to relive it almost for the first time with me playing it like this it's just I I'm a little bit blown away by how good a game this was to be quite honest with you you never really know what you're going to go into with a blind playthrough some of them haven't been that great that I've played on the channel when I've played them blind this has been right up there absolutely fantastic um, I will be doing a full write-up review of this game if you're interested in reading that then you can find that it'll be over on my medium page which is medium.com slash at turian shepherd i'll also be putting a tweet up with a link to it uh, when it goes live i imagine that will go live at some point in the next two weeks because i've got quite a lot on in my personal life at the moment um with being a dad and well countless other things going on so um that'll go up at some point in the next two weeks so i'll let everyone know when it's live and if you if you want to go and read it then you can go ahead and do that uh next up on the channel um i released a poll on twitter a couple of months ago asking if you guys wanted me to see me play through all of the assassin's creed games um i've played some of them not all of them uh so i think about 80 percent of you guys said you wanted to see me do that so the next game we're going to play in this slot is going to be the first assassin's creed game the original one from all those years ago um, and then once we finish that, we're going to jump back in with another Telltale title, which will be uh, The Walking Dead, the final season, which I've still not had a chance to play yet. So I've been saying for about a year that we're going to get around to playing it. That's going to be the next one we play after Assassin's Creed. So make sure you stick around for that. I've got plenty of other Telltale stuff to play as well. I've got um, managed to track down a copy of Jurassic Park, the game. So we're going to play that in the future. We still need to do Batman Season 2. We need to do... Uh, Guardians of the Galaxy, there's the Sam and Max games as well, um, which I've never played, so there's a whole bunch more of those to come. So many games I want to play on the channel, to be quite honest with you, but we're going to get around to them all slowly but surely. And I just really want to thank you guys for, for sticking around and watching this with me. Um, it's been a hell of a ride. I've really enjoyed playing it through and reading everything you guys have had to say about it. So if you've enjoyed the series, make sure you hit the like button. It does help the channel to grow, so I do appreciate it. Uh, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the notification bell if you're new or just haven't already done so. And I will see you all next time.